How would I remap Mac CMD to control keys and remote desktop connection for Mac application? I sometimes have to use Microsoft Remote Desktop Connection for Mac for remote access to a Windows 7 machine from an iMac running Macos X10.6.6, Snow Leopard. Making the mental switch to use the control key control in place of the command key CMD while in the remote desktop window, for example control C to copy instead of CMDC, is a pain and a source of constant errors. I would like to be able to map the CMD key to output a control key on my Mac, but only when accessing the Microsoft Remote Desktop Connection for Mac application. Remote Desktop Connection lets you map a number of other keys via its preferences, but not the CMD key. I.e. in any other Mac application, CMD would act like CMD. However, in Microsoft Remote Desktop Connection for Mac, CMD would act like control. Answering my own question. Come. Shortly after posting, I googled across an application called Carabina that does precisely what I needed it to do, in addition to a lot of other stuff. Specifically, you can map the left and right command keys to be control keys and only remote desktop connection in VMS. Microsoft Remote Desktop Beta adds support for CMD plus X slash C slash V as well as control plus X slash C slash V to cut slash copy slash paste within a remote session. Note. Clipboard redirection will be available in a later update. You can also add custom mappings by navigating to the resources slash keyboard directory within the application contents and opening the clipboard action transformations.xml file in a plain text editor. Update. You can simply set this checkbox in the Preferences, General section. Update 2. Some were suspicious of the Hockey App site, despite the author being Microsoft Remote Desktop. This TechNet blog post from Microsoft.com announces the beta app and provides the same Hockey App URL. Update 3. For those not willing to use Carabiner, there is little documentation on clipboard action transformations.xml above. However, the following keys can be mapped, left arrow, etc., slash, space, period, left bracket, right bracket, F1, etc. Also, shift combinations can be mapped with shift equals 1. Install the application Carabiner. Once installed, open Carabiner. From the Change Key tab, expand the For Applications section. Enable at Only Remote Desktop Connection Client subsection. Check Change Command Key to Control Key and RDC. Now when you use the new RDP app, you can continue to use CMD instead of control. Like previous answers, I too, used Carabiner. Most excellent app. What I did differently though, was to add a custom key mappings to mitigate the Mac command V. Control buttons in the terminal. In my situation, I'm using a Logitech keyboard so no Apple command key. Essentially, 
what I did was map the MAC command key to the control key. My reasoning was that I wanted to preserve common control key sequences that MAC maps to command key sequences, i.e. control F, for find. Also, I needed to preserve the true control sequences, such as control C for SIGINT. Basically we're multiplexing the control key sum. After installing Carabiner, I was not able to get control C to send the Unix, SIGINT, initially. However, once I modified the private.xml, I got that working. Steps Download the Carabiner DNG file from this URL. Double click the DNG file to install it. Once Carabiner is installed, bring up the key mappings. 3.1 Do not map the either command underscore L or command underscore R to anything. Leave them unchecked. 3.2 Map the control underscore L and AMP, control underscore R to the respective command underscore L and AMP, command underscore R. Next, edit the private.xml file. Helpful link, this URL. 4.1 Add the following snippet. Hit the reload button, and you should be good. Please note that in the terminal window, if you want to copy slash paste text, you will select it with the mouse or whatever. However, to now copy it to clipboard, you will need to use RT click and GT, copy from the mouse. Remember, we remapped Control C, which used to be copy, and is now SIGINT. I'm